We now return to the Kentucky Derby, where 90% of the audience roots for the horse with the cutest name. And they're off. It's Battleaxe, followed by Redbeard, followed by Bishop, followed by Smiling Pink Bear. Oh, my God, that's my horse. And on the outside, here comes Tiny Kitten Kisses. No, no, that one. And here comes It's Bedtime. Oh, I do not like him. <laughs> Meg, what's wrong? Some psycho just transferred to my school, and he's going to kill me. Ah! <laughs> Boy, she must really be PBSing, right? What? I mean, it's like pop a couple of tampons, you know? Stewie, do you even know what a menstrual cycle is? Uh, yeah, Brian. It's a good way to get around town, that's what it is. Oh, good. You're alone. Hey, Lois. Why are you wearing a robe? Well, I heard about how Peter's making you see him naked lately, so I thought the only way to get even is for you to see me naked. W really? Yeah, it only seems fair. You know what? That makes sense to me. I mean... All right, here we go. Ah! <laughs> you thought you were going to see my wife's penis, but no, it's mine. <laughs> you idiot! <laughs> Good morning, students. This is Principal Shepard with the morning announcements. Remember that all wagers on Friday's Meg Griffin slaughter must be on my desk by Thursday. Also, Zach Morris, if you could stop freezing time to talk to the camera, the day would go a lot faster. Oh my god, you guys, what am I gonna do? That psycho is going to kill me. Meg, you gotta find a way out of this fight. Yeah, Meg, you can do it. You're a smart woman, and women can do anything nowadays. I guess you're right. But it's not like it's the 1950s. So, I see you graduated number one in your class from Princeton. That's right. And I'm certified as an accountant and also have a law degree. That's all very impressive. We'll keep you in mind. Let's see. Pointy boobs, medium pointy boobs, not so pointy boobs. That's a shame. Hey, Mom, I need to transfer to a different school. Meg, we've been over this. Just because a Facebook page has over 2,000 likes doesn't mean you have to kill yourself. It's not that. Mom, please. There's other schools. Carlisle Academy leads the state in teen pregnancies, so I might meet somebody. Meg, Carlisle Academy's a private school. We can't afford it. Don't you remember how much money your father wasted so he could make grand staircase entrances? Hey, is Peter here? Uh, hang on. Peter! Why, Glenn Quagmire, it's been ten years if it's been a day. I figured out how to get out of this fight. All I have to do is get expelled. That sex tape I released should be everywhere by now. And then they'll have to kick me out of the school. Oh, come on, really? <gasps> Ooh. You know what? Good for her. Hey guys, you four are pretty much the toughest guys in school, right? What would it take to get you to beat up Mike Pulaski? Mental Mike? Are you kidding? Come on, guys, I'll do anything. I'll, I'll give you a swallow Friday. You mean a follow Friday? Oh, I've been doing Twitter all wrong. Okay, okay, I'll, I'll just pay you. Oh yeah? Well, you're looking at a thousand bucks for something like that. A thousand dollars? Right. But it's gonna be hard to get that kind of money. I mean, I'm not Judge Judy. Hi, I'm Judge Judy. I get paid $45 million a year to yell at people who have nothing. Now, here's an ad about a fat people disease you have. We now return to B-E-T-E-T. -E -T. Don't you need to phone home? Nah, i do it later. Brian Griffin? Uh, yeah, that's me. Here you go. Oh, oh, God! <laughs> What's in the box, Brian? <laughs> I got you good. I don't feel right. I want it back. And then another. <laughs> and then another. <laughs>